ಓಂ ಜ್ಞಾನ ತಿಮೇಂದ್ರ ಜ್ಞಾನಾರ್ಜನ ಶಲಾಕ್ಯ ಚಕ್ಷುರಂತಮೇನ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುವೇ ನಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಮನೋಭಿಷ್ಟ ಸ್ಥಾಪಿತ ಮೇನ ಭೂತಲೆ ಸ್ವರೂಪ ಕದಾಮಯ್ಯನ್ ದದತಿ ಸ್ವಪದಂತಿ ವಂದೇ ಹಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರು ಶ್ರೀಯುತ ಪದಕಂ ನಮ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರು ವೈಷ್ಣವ ಚೂಪಂ ಸಾಗರ ಜಾತ ಸೈಗಂಧಗುನಾಥ ತಂ ತಂ ಸಜೀವ ಸಾಧು ವೇದ ಸಾವದೂತ ಪರಿಜನ ಸಹಿತ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ದೇವ ಶ್ರೀ ರಾಧಾಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪದ ಸೈಗಂಧ ಲಿತಾ ಶ್ರೀ ವಿಶಾಖರ್ ತಂ ಚ ನಮೋ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪದಾಯ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪೃಷ್ಠಾಯ ಭೂತಲೆ ಶ್ರೀಮತಿ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ತಿನಾಮಿನೆ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ದೇವೆ ಗೌರವಾಣಿ ಪ್ರಚಾರಿಣೆ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ಶೂನ್ಯವಾದಿ ಪಾಸದೇಶ ತಾರಿಣೆ ನಮೋ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪದಾಯ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪೃಷ್ಠಾಯ ಭೂತಲೆ ಶ್ರೀಮತಿ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ತಿನಾಮಿನೆ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ದೇವೆ ಗೌರವಾಣಿ ಪ್ರಚಾರಿಣೆ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ಶೂನ್ಯವಾದಿ ಪಾಸದೇಶ ತಾರಿಣೆ ಹೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕರುಣಾ ಸಿಂಧು ದೀನಬಂಧು ಜಗತ್ಪತೆ ಗೋಪೇ ಗೋಪೇ ಗಂಧ ರಾಧ ಕಾಂತ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ತಪ್ತ ಕಾಂಚನ್ ಗೌರಾಂಗಿ ಶ್ರೀ ರಾಧೆ ವೃಂದಾವನೇಶ್ವರಿ ವೃಷ್ಮಾನು ಸುತೆ ದೇವಿ ಪ್ರಣಮಿ ಹರಿ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಪಂಚಕಲ್ಪತರುಭ್ಯಶ್ಚ ಕೃಪಾ ಸಿಂಧುವೇ ಉಚ ಪತಿತ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣೇಭ್ಯ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಜಯ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧ ಶಿವ ಸದಿ ಗೌರ ಭಕ್ತವೃಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಶ್ರೀಪ್ರಭಾ ಕೀ ಜಯ ಓವರ್ ಟು ಯು ಮೇಘನ ಮಾತಾಜಿ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಯಾ ರೀಡ್ ಕರ್ನ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಕರ್ ಸಕ್ತೆ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಸ್ ದ ಸ್ಟಾಫ್ ದಾಟ್ ಪ್ರಭು ಜಿ ವಿಲ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಯಾ ಶ್ಯೂರ್ ಮಾತಾ ಜಿ ಕೌನ್ ಸೆ ಪಡನ ಹೈ ಲೋಕಾ ಸೆ ಯಾ ಸಿ ಪ್ರಭು ಜಿ ಪ್ರಯನಾಲ್ ಪಯೂಷ್ ಸಭಾಯ ಓಕೆ ಪ್ರಯ ಪ್ರಯನ ಪ್ರಯನಾಲ್ ಭಾಗ್ಯೋಹಿಸ್ಟ್ರೀಮಂತ್ರ್ಸ್ಟ್ರೀಮಂತ್ರ್ಸ್ಟ್ರೀಮಂತ್ರ್ಸ್ಟ
प्रदीप प्रभु Some hundred and thousand of years ago, Lord Krishna appeared as Devati Putra Kapil Deva. His father name was Karda Kardama Muni. After Kapil Deva grew up, his father, according to the Vedic system, retired, took sannyasa, and left home to cultivate spiritual life. It is nothing one should rot in this material world. In this material world, throughout one's whole life, panchasudurvam uh, vanam vrajat. According to the Vedic injections, there are four ash ashramas and four varnas. These used to be followed very very strictly. After his son grew up, Kardama Mani. Became a strict follower of the Vedas, left home and put his wife in charge of his grown son, Kapila Dev. It is said, Kapila Dev, Kapila that was Sanket the Bhagwan, Lord Kapila is Bhagwan. Nowadays, Bhagwan is taken very cheaply because the word. is misuse but actually bhagwan is not an ordinary man avijana ti mam muda because bhagwan shri krishna appeared as human being fools and rascals mudas consider krishna as ordinary human as krishna himself states in bhagavad gita 7 chapter 13 verse dipir जगत मोहितम माम डिलूडेड बाय थ्री मोड्स गुडनेस फैशन एंड इग्नोरेंस द होल वर्ल्ड डज नॉट नो मी हु एम अब द मोड्स एंड इन एक्सोस्टिव yet there are mahatmas great souls who can who can understand krishna arjuna could understand that although krishna was playing the part of his friend he was nonetheless he was nonetheless the supreme personality of godhead arjuna was in perfect knowledge yet krishna instructed him for our benefit arjuna requested krishna instructions which are set forth for all human society after hearing bhagavad gita arjuna addresses krishna as parth nay as a param brahma param dhama the supreme brahman and the supreme entire god every person is actually brahman spiritual spiritual soul we are not actually the body awareness of am brahmasmi i am brahman is actual self realization according to vedic culture one must understand that he is brahman not the body we should not remain in ignorance like cats and dogs thinking i am this body i am american i am indian i am brahman i am shastriya i am hindu i am muslim and so on these are all bodily designations when one comes to spiritual understanding he understands am brahmasmi i am brahman this is called brahman realization it is not what we become brahman by some practice gold is gold even if it is covered with some dirt which can certainly be removed similarly if we all are brahman spirit spiritual soul but somehow or other we have become in contact with these material elements bhumi apo nalo vyahau and we have acquired bodily coverings consequently we think i am this body this is ignorance and unless one is enlightened by spiritual knowledge he remains animalistic is grace shaftar prabhu ji Uh, yes, Mandi. Sorry. Uh, understanding. Hold on. Understanding is called dharma. The ultimate goal of dharma is enunciated by Sri Krishna himself in Bhagavad Gita 18.166. Sarv dharman paritajya maam ekam sarnam vraja. Abandon all varieties of religion and just surrender unto me. On this earth, I have created so many dharmas. 
Hindu dharma, Muslim dharma, Christian dharma. These are all manufactured dharmas. But real dharma is attained when we come to the conclusion that Sri Krishna is everything. Again, in the Bhagavad Gita 7.19, Bahunam Gyan Manam, sorry, Bahunam Gyan Manamante, Gyan Van Maam Prabhadyate, Vasudeva Sarva Mithi, Pramahatma Sudurlava. After many births and deaths, he who is actually in knowledge surrender unto, surrenders unto me, knowing me to be the cause of all causes and all that is such a great soul is Sri Krishna. Janavam, the Krishna conscious movement is meant for the propagation. Sorry, Mantra. The Krishna consciousness movement is meant for the propagation of this message. We are not preaching a particular sectarian religious system, but a real religion. Dharma. Dharma to Saksad Bhagavatam Bhagavat Parinantam. No one actually knows what dharma is and no one can manufacture dharma. Dharma is the order of supreme being. No one can manufacture state laws. They are given by government. The simplest definition of dharma is that dharma is in the order of the supreme being. Being the, uh, Since the supreme being, God is one. His order must be one. How then can there be different dharmas? It is not possible. Different dharmas are created due to ignorance, which cause people to think in terms of Hindu dharma, Muslim dharma, Christian dharma, this dharma or that dharma. No, gold is gold. If Christian possesses some gold, does it become Christian gold? Gold is gold, whether possessed by Hindu, Muslim or Christian. According to the order of supreme personality of God, dharma means surrendering onto that supreme being. This is Bhagavata Dharma and everyone should be taught how to surrender unto God. God is one. There cannot be two gods. When there is competition, there is no God. Presently, there is different God on different street, on every street. But Krishna is not that kind of God. He is Supreme God and as Krishna himself stated in Bhagavad Gita. Mata Prataram Nanyat Kinchit Asti Dhananyad Jaya Nai Sarvam Idan Rotam Sutre Mani Gana Ida. O conqueror of wealth, there is no truth superior to me. Everything that rests up to me, upon me, as pearls are strung on the thread. Narendra the purpose of this Krishna conscious movement is to inform everyone that no one is superior to Krishna, God, because many young Americans and Europeans are fortunate and know nothing of any hood, j pod God. They have taken this bona fide Krishna conscious this movement seriously, Krishna's to Bhagwan Swayam, Bhagwan God in Sri Krishna, we have simply presented this information saying, here is God, Sri Krishna, because they have taken this seriously. Many young American Europeans are advancing in Krishna consciousness. Consequently, many people are surprised to see how Americans and Europeans have become such great devotees and are dancing in ecstasy. How is it they are so advanced? They have taken the information seriously, Krishna's to Bhagavan Swayam. Whether one touches fire blindly or knowingly, fire will burn. It is not that because the fire is touched by a child, fire will not burn. These young Westerners have touched fire and consequently it is acting as fire. Mataji. 
This information, Krishna to Bhagwan Swam, is not concocted, but is accepted by the Acharyas in the dis, uh, disciple succession. Disciplic succession. Although an impersonalist Sankaracharya has accepted Krishna as the supreme personality of Godhead, so have Raman Ramanuja Acharya, Madhavacharya, Vishnu Swami, Nimbarka, and Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and his followers. They all accepted Krishna and this as the supreme. Just as Krishna himself did. This is the simplest method. There is no need to speculate. What is God? Where is God? Why, foolish, why foolishly go on uh, searching? Here is God, Krishna. We may think that Krishna cannot be seen, but Krishna can appear in the form of his energy. Of course, a stone is not a God, but a stone is another one of the God's energy. Heat and light are not fire, but without fire, there cannot be heat or light. In that sense, Heat and light are non-different from fire. This material world is like heat and light of the supreme fire. Ek disha stiya sangher jotsna vistaren tiyata parasya brahma shaktis tadedham akilam jagat Just as a fire is situated in one place but spreads, illuminates all around the supreme personality of Godhead Param Brahma spreads his energies throughout this universe. Vishnu Puran 1.22.53 He spreads uh -huh. Yeah, the sun is situated in one place and its light and heat expand throughout the entire solar system. As soon as we, we can understand the sun is there. Since light and heat can be perceived by everyone, Krishna says in Bhagavad Gita 7.8 Par for Bhasmi Sashi Shuryo. I am the light of the sun and the moon. People are saying God while not realizing that they are saying God daily at every extent that when we perceive the energy of the Lord. Hare Krishna. Yes, mother. The young devotees in the Krishna conscious movement are, are presently worshipping Krishna. What are the signs of a devotee? The actual sign of a devotee is that he is no longer interested in material enjoyment. Bhaktiya Pareshanu Bhavo Viraktir Anyatra Cha Bhagavad Gita 11 chapter Sorry, Srimad Bhagavatam 11.2.42. The disciples of this Krishna conscious movement, consciousness movement, do not go to cinemas, restaurants, or clubs, and they do not smoke or drink. In European and in European and American countries, all these things are available and are very cheap, but these young people are not interested in them. They are simply interested in sitting on the floor and learning about Krishna consciousness. Why is this? They have actually rejected the material world. When one comes to detest material in, uh, enjoyments, one can understand that he has advanced spirituality. Spiritually, spiritual life does not mean taking sannyasa and then smoking or drinking tea. One must actually come to detest material life. One come to lose interest in material activities and become interested only in understanding of God, the supreme being, and His service. As enjoyed it as enjoined in Srimad Bhagavatam. Nayam deho nayam bhajam nirloke kastam kanam arhate vid bhajam ye. Of all the living entities who have accepted material bodies in this world, one who has been awarded this human form should not work hard day and night simply for sense gratification which is available even for dogs and hogs that eat stool. The word vidbhujam means stool eater. Eaters, hog, work hard day and night simply eating stool and become stool contained 
because stool contains chemical and hydrophosphates the hog gets strength and becomes very fat and enjoys sex in any case human life is meant not for imitating the life of a hog but for the pascha austerity nanja puji tapo divyam putra ka yena satvam shuddhet yasmat brahm sukham tvanantam rather my dear boys one should engage in penance and austerity to attain the divine position of devotional service by such activity one's heart is purified and when one's heart, when one attains this position he attains eternal blissful life which is transcendental to material happiness and which continues forever bhagavatam fifth canto this is the meaning of vedic civilization the so- the society of varna sarama varna varnasrama dharma composed of brahmanas shastriyas vaishyas shudras brahstas vanaprastas brahmacharyas and sanyasis is meant to elevate people gradually to the perfect stage of understanding god the whole aim of the different varnas and ashramas is the worship of the supreme lord one can attain this understanding through this social system which admits of gradations when one goes to school he begins with the first grade then progresses to the second third and so forth in this way one make progress when human society accepts varnashram dharma it can gradually come to understanding of brahman by birth everyone is a shudra therefore everyone has to ed- has to be educated the word the with the vya means twice born once is first born through the womb of a mother and once next birth is given by the spiritual master and vedic knowledge vedic knowledge is the mother and the spiritual master is the father when once is twice born uh, dwija he receives a sacred thread from the spiritual master and begins to learn about spiritual life he is then allowed to read the vedic literatures in a way one become a son of vedic literature nigam kalpa tarur galitam phalam shrimad bhagavatam is the essence of vedic culture it is a wishful fulfilling tree and we can take whatever we want from it vedic knowledge is perfect and if we want to come to know it we must take shelter of a bona fide spiritual bona fide guru tad vijnartham sa guru eva bhi gache yes uh, unfortunately in this age uh... people forget the aim of life like the supreme lord himself comes the supreme lord is sent out of compassion because he is more anxious to have us return home back to god than than we are to go because we are in ignorance we do not know anything about the kingdom of god we know nothing about how to get there or how to get it we have forgotten all this the poor krishna comes at intervals or senses representative of the pure devotee sometimes he becomes personally and sometimes he senses in incarnation or regression okay it's already 626 so we can stop here anyone uh, yes, yes, ma'am. yes ma'am. Ji, uh, two points i want to share here uh, one is like uh, uh, Prabhupada so, mentioned like uh, the, 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 the uh, Kali Yoga, like uh, the symptoms of Kali Yoga. So, Prabhupada Ji was telling us that how to understand Kali Yoga. So, it's a good thing. 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 People don't understand it. तो इसलिए भगवान को हम समझ नहीं सकते तो मतलब और हार्ड हो जाता है कलयुग में तो फिर प्रभु बाजी बताते थे कि इसलिए फिर चेतन महाप्रभु आए और उन्होंने हरि नाम जैसे हरि नाम के माध्यम से लोगों तो कृष्ण तक पहुंचाने की मतलब कृपा करी तो या दैट पॉइंट आई लाइक एंड 
एंड चेक इन पॉइंट लोग जैसे लोग बोलते हैं कि कहाँ है भगवान जैसे पप्पा जी बता रहे थे कि लोग पूछते हैं क्वेश्चन की कहाँ है भगवान तो मुझे दिखते तो है नहीं तो मैं कैसे बिलीव करूँ तो पप्पा जी बता रहे थे कि अगर हम ध्यान से देखें तो हमें हर जगह भगवान देखेंगे और वो बता रहे थे कि श्लोक स्पोर्ट बताते हैं कि मैं ही सूर्य हूँ और मैं ही चंद्रमा तो अगर हम देखना अपने नेचर को ही देखें आसपास की चीज चीजों को देखें तो हम भगवान को समझ सकते हैं तो या दैट पॉइंट आई राइट या वेरी नाइस पॉइंट प्रभुजी थैंक यू मारी प्रदीप प्रभुजी यू वांट टू शेयर एनीथिंग नथिंग न्यू मदर ओके धनंजय प्रभुजी हरे कृष्णा मुझे एक पॉइंट अच्छा लगा कि इधर बोल रहे थे कि ऋषभ देव कि शुड नॉट स्पॉइल योर लाइफ बाय वर्किंग हार्ड लाइक फॉक्स रादर देन बोले कि माय डियर बॉयज यू शुड एंगेज इन पेनांस एंड ऑस्टेरिटी टू अटेन डिवाइन पोजीशन ऑफ डिवोशनल सर्विस और उस एक्टिविटीज क्या होगा कि हमारा हार्ट प्योरीफाई हो जाएगा जो हमारा हार्ट प्योरीफाई हो जाएगा तो हम इटरनल ब्लिसफुल लाइफ में जाएंगे वो तो ट्रांसीडेंटल है और मतलब वो मटेरियल मटेरियल हैप्पीनेस ट्रांसीडेंटल है और वो कंटिन्यू रहेगा यस नाइस पॉइंट रूम जी सो एनीवन एल्स वांट टू शेयर एनीथिंग ओके is grace the shabda prabhu ji can you please say the prayers yes sure mata ji so ya vansha galpat rovesh kripa sindhu gaya vacha prita naam pavane pyo vaishnav ek namo namo jagat vishnu prapat ki jai thank you jai